It's empty right now, but it gets crazy during lunchtime. I'm your Gretna neighborhood reporter, John Brown, at Gretna High School. And in the spirit of inclusion, one student brought a program to her school to provide a safe space for students of all abilities to eat lunch. No, you, you first say something, well. Gretna High School sophomore Kate Bryson loves lunch. What does lunch mean to you? It means a lot. Like, I get to hang out with my friends, just, like, eat together, and, like, like play sports together. Take a short walk from the Gretna High School cafeteria, and you'll find a room full of laughter, conversation, and good food. What's your, what's your favorite food? What do you like to eat at lunch? Steak. <laughs> Why is that? Because it's good. I said Senior Addison Dow wanted to make a change at her school after she felt alone at lunch and noticed students with disabilities did not have anyone to sit with. That's why she brought Lunch Buddies, a program where people of all abilities can be included. It's a rewarding experience for me every single day and I look forward to it. It's my favorite time of the day to see all the smiles on the faces with my peers and students with disabilities, and I really do enjoy it. Dow says often a normal cafeteria can be too loud and often lead to sensory overload issues for special education students. Not everyone likes to eat in the lunchroom where it's very loud. Sometimes people want to feel like they have a reserved space and just a space of their own. Now the lunch hour has a lasting impact. It's made a huge difference in Gretna. Just people are, lo are actually looking forward to lunch. They're not hiding away and they can actually open up and create bonds with all their peers and with people they didn't think that they would connect with. At Gretna High School, I'm John Brown, your Gretna Neighborhood Reporter.